Hello everyone and welcome back to the Tales of the Tempest. Last time we played, we went to the heart of the desert, the capital of Lemon, then explored a little bit around here and there. But we also got a little Rubia kidnapped by Romy and Lucius as we were fighting against Lucius himself. As you might notice, the uh, the sound sounds a little bit different because I'm doing this audio post recording. Because I was thinking of cutting out a lot of the running around and small fights that happen, as those do take a lot of time, and might not be as interesting to watch as some of the other bits. So if you guys like this way of uh, the episode, or if you like the episodes this way, then I could make the the rest of the episode similar to this. But anyway, let's go ahead and see what Chaos and the group have been up to since then. Turkis, did you have something you wanted to talk about? Rubia. Hmm, can't sleep. You need to rest while you can. I know, but... You worry about Rubia, right? Of course I'm not. Well, m maybe a little bit. I never thought something would get me like this. Well, you each spend your whole life with the other by your side. Sometimes that makes it hard to recognize your own feelings until you're apart. I'm sure Rubia is longing to see you right now, too. Hmm? You really think so? I do. Whenever Rubia and I would talk, it would always be about you. That shows just how much she cares for you. That's why you need to save her. If anyone can do it, you can. Thanks, Tilkis. Rubia is like a little sister to me. We're going to save her no matter what. Yeah! I trust you brought this patient. Yeah, I got it right here. Now keep your promise and give Rubia back. First, the patient. Come part ways up the hill by yourself. Hmm, this is a wonderful patient. This is a wonderful patient, thanks. <laughs> I wonder how many Lycan souls this holds. Damn you, we gave you the patient. Give Rubia back now. K Chaos, I, I can't come back. What are you talking about, Rubia? I just don't know what to believe anymore. I, c I can't come back. R Rubia, what the hell did you do to Rubia? We didn't do anything. She came to this conclusion all by herself. She realized what terrifying beasts Lee can far, and she realized what, she re what that really means. That's right, it's you. She realized that you are terrifying Lee Kenf. M me Because of me? Unfortunately, it appears she doesn't want to go. Thank you for the patient, though. You're all free to go. Because the Le I'm a Leomonian? Rubia won't come back? Rubia, is it really my fault? B because I'm a Leomonian? Chaos, I I'm sorry, I... I it's fine. If that's really what you think, th that's fine. Hmm? What is this light? What is happening? Is that Panda the patient too? Shoot, they're resonating. We'll be taking that patient as well. N not a chance. This is a memento of my mom. I will never let you have it. M mom? They make us repeat ourselves, Lee Kenf. Wait, you said you would let everyone go if they gave you the patient? Was that a lie? We didn't know they had two of them. A liar. Everyone, run! Obnoxious bread. We'll just kill them and take that patient. And then we'll send you to meet your parents. Just stay quiet. <gasps> so, so it was you that killed them. What a stupid girl. It must run in the family. H how dare you lie to me. Oh, wait. You don't stand a chance against her alone. Don't throw your life away. Lucius, stay the hell away from her. I'd worry about myself if I were you. Now give me that patient. Tommy, I mean, stop! Case is my. <sighs> Worthless worms when the gate opens. 
Damn it. I'm amazed you managed to push Romy that, that far. Case, if you could use strength like yours, will you join us? I will handle things with his holiness personally. Are you crazy? You killed my dad and Ruby's parents. I would never join you. That's right. No matter what, we will never join you. Even after seeing this. <laughs> he, he looks just like Chaos. What is this? What the? Who are you? I am your younger brother, Chaos. N no way. I'm not just gonna believe something like that out of the blue. You were left with mom while I stayed with dad. We were separated almost from birth. You're lying. Y you're lying. I tell you no, I'm telling the truth. Can't believe Luke is this Chaos's brother. But he did say something like... I am Chaos's shadow. I could have never imagined this. Let me say it once again. Chaos, join me. Even if the Lee Kenf hunt ends, the persecution never will. That's why we have to use the law of life. Save the Lee Kenf. Already said I don't believe you. You can cut the crap about being my younger brother. You're a Lemonian too, aren't you? Seems our paths have already diverged beyond reconciliation. It's a shame we didn't come to an understanding. Uh, wait, are you running away again? Damn it. That's right, Rubia. Are you okay? I'm alright. Thank goodness you're okay. Rubia, don't try to push yourself too far. Case was really worried about you. He couldn't sit still. For Forrest, you don't have to tell her dad. Everyone, I'm sorry for worrying you. Thank you, Case. I was so confused. Whatever. It's not like it's the first time I've had to save the stubborn princess. <laughs> well, excuse me for being such a stubborn princess, but I would say I'm still more reliable than you are. Yeah, right. I always think things through before I jump in, like any of your thoughts are going to be any good. <laughs> My goodness, as soon as she's saved, the fighting starts again. You two are, you two are cute together. The dear brother, don't tease me like that. By the way, I overheard those two talking while I was captured. They still need to get a lot more patience. Hmm, we need managed to keep this one safe for now, but even without it. They're planning to use the law of life. What is Lucius really after? That is the real question. The appearance of the spots doesn't seem to have deterred him. The law of life grants power over death. Can it really be used to say? The, the law of life gr uh, grants power over death. Can it really be used to save the world? <laughs> save the world, that's ridiculous. Just look at what they've done. How to imagine they want to save the world when more people die from spot attacks every day. I'm more worried about the law of life itself. Why does his holiness know about such a closely guarded Lemonian secret? There is only one way to find out. It is not necessarily hidden, but the village I was raised in is north of here. North of here? In Algum? Yes, there is a small village within the forest. Its name is Sansa. The eight Lemonians that set out for Janna 14 years ago were from Sansa. Sansa. Sansa is, the, is in the heart of the forest. It is a frigid place and orgs are ever present. That is why the church and the knights haven't moved against. So I think someone there might know something about the law of life. What about the Pope? Shouldn't we go be going to stop him? And Lucius too. I understand why you're worried about Luke. Not only is he your brother, he is a Lemonian, just like us. And yet he himself has captured many Lemonians who now suffer. Why? Why would he go so far to aid the Pope in his pursuit of the law of, law of life? To find that answer, we first need to go to the Sansa, right? I'm with Forrest in this one. If we learn more about the law of life, we might learn of some way to put a stop to it too. What do you say, Chaos? Hmm, okay, I get it. Let's go to the Forest Village. Off we go then. Hmm, I don't get the sense Forrest is happy to be returning home. Remember, he left everything behind when he fled his homeland. What do you mean? After the Janna incident, he barely escaped to send Shibia with his life. When he escaped, there were other survivors, but he didn't have time to think about ever anyone but himself. He still feels like he left them to die. Part of why, oh. part of why we came to Orella was to lay the past to rest. For him, the Jenna incident hasn't ended yet. This is going to be a bit of sweet homecoming. No doubt about that. Hey, Rubia, what's wrong? Lemonians are terrifying monsters. Even though Lucius is a Lemonian, that's what he said about them. Why would he say something like that? Chaos has been my friend since we were little kids, and Forrest is a precious companion. I just don't know what to believe anymore. 
Rubia, it's dangerous to be out here all, all alone. Chaos? Hmm? What's wrong? That worrisome expression doesn't suit you. How rude. Even I worry about stuff sometimes. Hmm, did Lucio, Lucio say something to you? Yeah. Something you couldn't get out of your head, huh? Okay, yes, can I ask you a question? What did you think when you found out you were a Lemonian? I honestly couldn't be believe it. At f first I was like, why? But at the same time, it was also kind of a relief. Mm, why? At the very least, I me it meant I had a real connection with my dad. The one who raised me, I mean. Dad had, dad had something he always used to say to me. No matter how tough things get, you get, you have to face them head on. You can't run from reality. You have to accept whatever life sends your way and keep on living. Accept whatever life sends your way. Accept whatever life sends your way. Even if I am a Leomunian, it doesn't change the fact that I'm chaos calls. I will never stop being me. I think my dad wanted to tell me to be proud of my Leomunian heritage. Forrest told me the same thing. I'm not saying transforming into a beast isn't terrifying to a human. But you know what, Rubia? I'm still the same old me. At the very least, I hope you get that. I get what you're trying to say. You know, maybe nobody ever told Lucius that. If he really hates the Lemonian blood flowing through his veins, it's really sad. I want to tell him it's okay to be proud of who he is. Okay, yes, I think you got a bit cooler while I was gone. What do you mean a bit? I've always been cool. You just never realized it. <laughs> Is that right? I seem to remember a certain someone getting locked in the shed and crying. That was when I was a kid. And you were the one who locked me up in the first place. <laughs> That's true. We've been together all this time. And I still doubted you. I'm sorry, Case. Eh, don't worry about it. But man, if you apologize to me, I bet pigs are gonna fly today. That's yeah, just not right. What's that supposed to mean? Now, come on, we need to head to Sansa. Thanks, Gaius. That's right. Even if he's a Lemonian, the Gaius I've always known is still right here. Even if humans are afraid of Lee Kanf, I will believe in my friends. Just like my father believed in Case's father. <laughs>